Hi everyone, this is the Legendary I'm back again with more. This time, I just have to say that I am back. I'm sorry for for not uploading, but I've just been doing a lot. I've been playing Yokai Watch, the video game. It wasn't for any of my channels, so sorry about that, but I got I got that. Which is why I was playing. So, we left off at 11. So, I'm gonna show you what we get in, in day 12. In day 12, for the Star Wars event calendar, the Lego Star Wars event calendar, we get a weird looking weapon rack. It looks like a weapon rack. We have some. I have some blasters to probably try and take out the Jedi. Probably. Maybe. I'm not really sure. Now, let's go on to 13. If I can find 13. Okay, it's at the top. 13. I already opened these. I just, I'm just going over these as a little mini review. And for 13, we get a droid. It looks looks to be some kind of astromech droid, but I'm not really sure. Please tell me in the comments what are these things, because I'm not sure what some of their awesome creations are. Because they all look cool. Now, let's go on to 14. Day number 14, you get... Get something that, that most people in Star Wars know. Which is the Millennium Falcon. And there you go. That's the Millennium Falcon that you get in day 14. And for day number 15, you get... Hold on, I'm trying not to, trying not to make that, the background fall down. I'm trying to get them on there. Okay. So, for day number 15, we get a blaster. Like, a stud shooter, another stud shooter. So, for day number 15, we get a green stud shooter. Which has a special feature where you can shoot off both studs at once or just one separately. Let me just show that off. I just shot one, and I could use the rest of the ammo that I have to just reload, or I could just do it again except for shoot both of them off at the same time, which is what I'm going to demonstrate. See, if you put your finger right in between both of the buttons, then they can actually activate the mechanism which will let you shoot both of them at once. One that was a little bit late and one just shot across the room. But that's the reason why they give you extras. So since I lost them, I could find them later. And now I can just refill the stud shooter right now. So Next, we'll get for day number 16. Yeah, 16. We get... We get an old Lego set. That was released a while ago. I think it was like... 2013, 2014. It's called... Hold on. I just trying to find that green stud. So, so there's one of them. But, it's called the A-Wing Fighter. I really didn't know, but, um... I looked up, and then it's called the A-Wing Fire. I'm not really a Star Wars fan. Like I said, I'm just now trying to figure out all these names of all these weird things that I don't know the names. They're weird to me because I'm not really familiar with anything Star Wars. 
And I know that the other statue, if you heard it earlier, it went right to the floor. So, I'll go pick that up later. Now, day number 17, we get another minifigure. Which is... Meh. I don't even know. Can you please tell me his name in the comments? At least tell me... At least give me an idea an idea of who this guy might be or who is he trying to be well well they both had different faces so can't say that was on the stormtroopers from from one of the most recent videos um I'm not sure and plus there are two ways that you can do it two well three See, this is one of the setups. Another setup is if you probably could just take it off and just leave that part off if you want to. And then if you want a mask, then you can just snap it on the bottom part. And then there you go, you got a mask form. And it comes with two of them, so, so then you could just have... One up there and then one down there. It'll look weird, but... Um... Might be fine. Day number 18. This is called... The at -AT. I'm not really familiar on this thing, really. The only source that I would watch that Star Wars would be... Star Wars Rebels. So, I'm not really sure about this. So, you have to tell me. You have to tell me where this thing come from and how did it come to be. Because I'm not really sure. And now, number 19. Day number 19, this is what you... Get, hold on. You get this weird, I'm not even sure, it looks like some kind of Star Destroyer. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure about half of these things. So I had to please tell me what, what some of these things are. Then, there's a green laser. So I guess, well, if you actually have the parts, they could take out the green laser. And then you can take one of these from from one of your future, you know, take this from one of your future doors. And then you can put that lightsaber piece like that. And then there you go. You have your own lightsaber. You have a third one, actually, because you're going to get two. You're going to get two in one of the next ones I'm going to show you. So, now, this is day number 20, which we're getting more recent. Uh, okay, so, for day number 20, we get this weird thing that flies up in the space, apparently. I'm really not even sure what this is, or what it's supposed to be, but it's about as high as a at, -AT in the at, -AT is about as high as a minifigure. It's a little bit higher than a minifigure. Because of that head. So, let's go on to day number 21. 21. 21. Okay. I know I can't see me. See my hand movements. Now, this is one of the ones I'd encourage you to, to try and, um, to try and figure out a way to get a lot of these studs. Because... If you have more studs that look the same color, then you can end up having your own war. Like I just found this piece in my collection, it's because I have a lot of Legos. Now I have an even pile of these things. Now I just know that one of the Legos that I shot fell on the floor. But you just have to wish me good luck on trying to find that. But anyway, 
you could just shoot this thing off like I did with the other thing. And that's lost somewhere. It's okay. I'll I'll get more Legos and maybe I'll find a piece that suits this. But there's also a little control panel. I wonder what is this for? Let's see. Day number twenty two. This is this is actually one of the best ones. I think this is actually my favorite one. This is actually the best one to add the whole event calendar to me. R2-D2 as a reindeer. So you get R2-D2 as a reindeer, like I just said. But the reason why it's cool is because I never had an R2-D2 before. Ever. I've always wanted an R2-D2, but I didn't really have... I didn't really care about R2-D2 at all. I just wanted R2-D2. Just, just for fun. And, the reason why I wanted R2-D2 was because I thought it looked cool. But then, but then, um, I didn't really have any interest in Star Wars at all, so... So if I bought one of the Star Wars sets, it just would have been a waste of money. So, there you go. Day 22 is Reindeer, um, Reindeer R2-D2. And if you want him not to be a reindeer, then just take off the top. And then there you go. You have regular R2-D2 for any day. Then... Here's R2-D2 on Christmas Eve slash Christmas. Now, day number 23. This one. This one actually kind of blew me away. I like the... I like how... I like how the build of this thing is just pretty cool. I like the way it's built. I mean, it kind of looks like it would just hover... Over like Ray Spear. Like, look like it'll just be hovering like that. And like, but, but then it just slides. It slides across this area. Like, slides like, wee. Okay. And then you actually have to build, have to build this thing in two parts. And then you just have to connect these two together. But the thing about this set is just, you have to look at the picture and try and figure out, how is this thing even built? And just hope that you built it right, too. For everything, that's how it is. And the advent calendars, they don't really give you too much instruction, because you're supposed to be able to do all this on your own. But I'm at that level, so that's why I'm able to do it, barely. This is this the snow sled, which is what our last character is going to be riding in, and they actually show in the box that R2-D2 is a reindeer, actually leading the last main character here, which is day 24, which is today, day 24, R2-D2 Santa Claus! Yes, this is day 24. I, we have actually went through all of the LEGO Star Wars advent calendars so far. Oh no, not so far. We've seen everything from the advent calendar. And tomorrow is Christmas Day. And after Christmas, and... And when I'm done seeing what I got on Christmas Day, then I will show you what I got. Which is going to be pretty cool. But that will be on my second channel, though. But. But, um. But the last thing I have to say is, right now, for right now, is. Is have a Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year. May the force be with you. And hopefully you enjoyed this video. 
like if you want, favor if you want, and subscribe for more awesomeness. See you next time, bye, and I'm proven to be legendary.